<laughs> Until Dawn launch trailer <sighs> on the PS5. Let's go right to it, man. <laughs> Bullet. All right, here we go. Here we go. You need to listen to me. You need to go down to the mines. Hey, Sam. Sam looking fine. I can't lie to you. What is it like a movie? What's in the mind, Sam? Tell me. In this little game you're playing so diligently. Man, this looks clean. That you most dislike. Oh my god. I told you. Ooh, give me that finger, Mike. And you think that these four people are getting what they deserve? Now what gives you the right to play God? Why are you doing that? Maybe you don't like them as much as you pretend to. I don't know. Stop it. We can't get along for ten minutes, and maybe we need a little bit of a break, right? That's ironic coming from you. That's really ironic coming from you. Please teach you. <sighs> Listen, I'm about to break this down like we're in chemistry class, okay? First of all, man, this game has been out, what, for like, what, nine, almost ten years. I think, uh, I think next year is going to make ten years, right, since the game's come out. Let me explain something to you. This is one of my favorite games of all time. We got Until Dawn, Remaster, Remake, whatever you guys want to call it, coming out on a PS5. First of all, let's just break this down. First of all, we all know Sam. Look, I had a big crush on Sam. Sam was my baby. Bro, this looks more of like a... I, I get like a... I get more of like a scary movie vibe. Because obviously, like, if you play this game on a PS4... This, this game dropped on PS4, by the way. If you guys didn't know, like, 10 years ago. If you played this on a PS4, you would know that, like, it was so... It was so crazy because at that time, it was, what, 2015, bro? When we had the PS4, we had the touchpad... So, so you can, like, turn on, like, the flashlight on your phone. Um, what do you call it? Like, it, it, the graphics were just, like, out of this world. But we'd never seen something like this before. Um, like, and, and so, like, and obviously, like, you know, we're in 2024 now. So, like, you know, games has definitely, you know, I, I don't want to say caught up. But games has definitely advanced, you know, in a way where, you know, a lot of these, you know, where, like, when we have a PS5, bro, like, bro, like, the game pops. And I'm not even talking about Until Dawn. I'm talking about, like, a lot of these games that, like, a lot of these games that we play now, like, we're kind of, like, I don't want to say that we're spoiled, bro, but, like, bro, bro, we, like, we tend to forget what we had back then. We tend to forget how lucky we are because, bro, like, only 10 years ago, a game like Until Dawn looked absolutely ridiculous, you know? A game like uh, Detroit Becoming Human looked absolutely, it was ahead of its time, bro. It was literally ahead of its time. It was crazy. A game like, um, like, bro, Batman Arkham Knight or, yeah, Batman Arkham Knight. That came out, what, 2015 as well, I think. Bro, that was ahead of its time. You have to understand that a lot of these games, like, like you know, if you compare them to, you know, a lot of these games nowadays, all right, cool, like, graphics, whatever. But you have to understand, bro, back then, bro, 10 years ago, 9 years ago, when we had these games, bro, it was absolutely incredible, bro. Like, these graphics, it blew us away. Like, yeah, cool. Like, if you look at the GTA 5 on a PS3, you know, right now in 2024, you know, you, you're going to be looking at the graphics like, bro, like, like we got hyped over this? Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy, right? It's crazy on how much our brain has, like, developed of us playing, like, all these video games nowadays because, like, we're so used to good graphics that, like, bro, if we take a look back at the PS3 graphics for GTA 5, bro, we're going to be, bro, we're legit going to be looking like, bro. We legit got hyped for this. And to be real, bro, that was, that's what, like, that was the thing that, like, captivated us. That looked great to us in, in 2013, bro, those graphics. Now, you know, if we look at GTA, you know, on the PS5, or we look at GTA on the PC, oh, my goodness, bro. Like, we're just, like, bro, we're, like, we're playing a Fast and Furious game. Like, bro, like, like legit. Like, have you ever played, have you ever seen, like, um... GTA 5 on like a on like a really powerful uh PC and it's like a uh it's like a um 
graphics test or whatever on YouTube. And he, like the rain looks really like like the rain on the road looks really like shiny. Like, it looks real life. Like it, it's crazy on like how graphics has progressed in the last 10 years alone. So, um, you know, to see Until Dawn look like this, bro, it looks more of like a scary movie, um, which I like. I'm not saying that I don't like. I like that a lot. Um, bro, look at Jessica. Like Mike, Mike still looks like Mike, bro, but it looks it looks real, bro. This looks like a TV show. It looks like a movie. Bro, look at Jessica. Oh my goodness. Now listen. I'm gonna put y'all on game. Hopefully somebody can like make like a side to side, like whatever. But this, this I'm look, this is legit, bro. I don't know if you guys can like pull up Jessica. Like I don't like bro, I don't know. I'm gonna try I don't even know where my phone is. Go on your phone, look up like a Jessica, whatever, but like scars on her face, whatever, and put that like next to the screen, bro. The difference is crazy. Look at the difference, bro. This looks like something you'll see out of like a Netflix show, bro. I'm not even, listen, I know I'm glazing or whatever, but bro, I'll continue to glaze. This is absolutely ridiculous. I want, bro, I'm, I'm trying to break this down like we're in chemistry class. Look at this, bro. Look at the blood, bro. Look at the, 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 my mouse is bugging. My bad, y'all. But bro, look at this. Like, look, look at the like the bruising. Look at the blood. Like, look how like the how dark it looks. Look at the surrounding. Look, bro, this looks super like cinematic. It looks super like movie like, bro. Super movie like. This is incredible, bro. Um, and I think Ballistic Moon worked on this as well, bro. Hey, you guys got all my respect with this one, bro. Like, bro, look at Chris. Like, Chris looks like he just went through it. I mean, and, and to be honest with you, bro, all these characters went through it, you know, throughout the entire story mode. Bro, like, they legit went through it, you know, each chapter, you know, either somebody dying or whatever, you know, depending on your uh, choices or whatever. Um, bro, everybody went through it. Like, his face looks rough. He got a bunch of dirt on his face and stuff like that. Look at, look at all the grain, the grains of dirt. Oh, bro, this is ridiculous, bro. This is nasty. Right? And look, listen, look, Sam C still looks clean. My baby. Man, this looks more and more like a movie, bro. This is incredible. And then this scene right here with Michael, bro, where Michael got uh, got his finger stuck in like the little saw thing or whatever. Bro, look at like his 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 body. Uh, pause. Look at like his arms and like his his, <laughs> his face and stuff like that, bro. Looks all like dirty and ran through. Like, this is incredible, bro. This is incredible, man. And then, bro, uh, I think his name was uh, Matt. I think this is his name was Matt. I think, right? Was his name? Was his? Matt? I think it was his name was Matt, right? Oh, he was dating Emily. Yeah, I forgot. Bro, he looks like he looks different. It's like his. It's like he added some type of like, like some type of like curl, like uh, curl like grease to like his head or something like that. It, it, he looks a little different, but at the same time, he looks like Matt from the original game. You guys gotta remember, bro. We haven't seen a new Until Dawn uh, game since what nine years ago, um, and then ten years later, bro. This thing is looking absolutely, bro. Look at this, bro. Y'all not, bro. Y'all, you're not seeing what I'm seeing right now, bro. Pull up a picture of Emily on your phone right now and put it next to the screen. Look at this, bro. We can see the pimples. First of all, yo, yo, Emily, you got to lay off the soda, bro. That's how you get pimples. Bro, look. She got the pimple right here. She looks in distress. You can see the facial emotions. You can see, like, the, like, like the cracking on like the, on, like, the lips. Oh, man. This is, I'm not trying to roast her or whatever. I'm just, like, obviously, like, she's, she's in a bad predicament right now. But, like, bro, like, look at the hair. The hair looks, cl it's crazy, bro. I'm trying to tell you, bro. This looks, this looks straight like a movie, bro. This looks straight like a movie. For 10 bro. minutes and... And then he, uh, he talking about some. Let's just be cool for 10 minutes. Like, you didn't set everything up, you bum. All right, man. Hopefully, you guys uh, enjoyed this. Make sure you guys like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Um, when this game comes out October 4th, best believe I'm covering all types of cutscenes. Um, it's crazy because um, I remember, like, um, I think last year. I think last year, whenever I was, like, you know, there were so many games dropping in 2023. Uh, I remember telling myself, I was like, damn, man, imagine if I started this whole, like, video game reacting thing um, 10 years ago, you know, um, you know, like, in 2013. I can actually, like, you know, react to, like, a lot of the cutscenes and, and, uh, from Until Dawn. And that was actually one of my favorite games, you know, uh, growing up. Um, but I always thought to myself, dang, man, imagine me actually, like, reacting to, like, Until Dawn's, like, death scenes or whatever, uh, like, when it, when it first came out, you know, uh, like, nine years ago. Uh, and now, you know, 
that the game's actually like really like re-releasing with like better graphics and stuff like that, man. Um, it, it's kind of crazy how like it, it's crazy. That was it. This game came out nine years ago. It's crazy, man. Again, comment down below, man. What do you guys think about this? Uh, drops on the fourth, I believe. Um, it comes out for PS5 and PC, bro. Listen, I know P. Listen, all you PC people, bro. <laughs> Especially if, bro, if your PC's decked out, bro, you're gonna be having all types of graphics. It's crazy. So, uh, again, man, I know I said the outro like two, three times. My bad, y'all. I'm just super excited about this game, man. Listen, I'm too, too excited, bro. I'm too excited. As you can see, I can't stop smiling right now, man. Uh, until dawn for the PS5, man. Who knew? Who knew? like? And here's the thing. I thought like Detroit Become Human would come to the PS5 like before Until Dawn. Like you know, there's not like there's no shot. Until Dawn, a game that was like that came out nine years ago, is coming to the PS5, and you know it is, bro. And listen, I'll say it, I'll say it like it is, right? Call me what you want, right? Whatever. I think Until Dawn is one of the best games to ever drop on a PlayStation 4. I don't care what you say, um, go argue with your mom, um, whatever, man. But yeah, whenever it comes to the PS4 itself, bro, this is one of the best games that the PS4 has ever dropped, ever. So, other than that, man. Again, I'm going to say the outro one more time. Last time, I promise. Please, guys, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And...